Alrighty then, I guess we are ready to roll. <clears throat> Three, two, Gotta start off one, battlefield, okay. Go! Yeah, now here's a matchup where I think uh, Wick might be able to sort of use. He's, because he's obviously a big fan of the counter, right? Yeah. And I feel like he might be able to use that with impunity uh, against Isabel Fair and Bear. Yeah. Because, oh, he tried to counter the Lloyd. But, I mean, you gotta have to, like, get there first, like, get, like, in range of. Or just, like, actually catch B Rice. Like, actually using the fair. Uh, because right now he's doing a. Uh, just like a good job of uh, playing around uh, our set. Obviously, if you can see, it's like now he's gone. And he's only sitting on like seven. Okay. okay. Let's play. Oh, did he throw the uh, Eha? Or. He threw. Yeah, he threw the Eha. Uh, Oh, oh like, I had to read this. Yeah, he was too slow on that. Oh, very good dash attack. Keep forgetting that like dash attack is too easy. And yeah, yeah it's not some, close enough. Sometimes you're just a little bit too far away. Yeah. See, so, yeah, I feel. I mean, in the villager slash Isabel matchup, it's definitely a matchup where you have to. You have to understand that their options to get somebody off of them are extremely limited. Yeah. So you have to... It, it's an exercise in staying in, and that's what can be hard for a lot of players that haven't refined their ability to stay in, because they definitely know how to go in, because it's easy to just like, oh, I hold forward yeah. and hit the green button. But... A lot of the times, it's really hard to stay in effectively because, again, you have to understand what the defense up, the defensive option is for the character, for the player, and a lot of the times in the vill villager matchup, the things you have to watch out for is are they going to defensively nair or are they going to uh, try to pocket? Yeah. It, it's like nair, pocket, and then like land with... Uh, Land with it. Yeah. Because if they're able to do one of those things, then they get to reestablish neutral. They get to, you know, set up Lloyd. They get to start bearing and bearing, and they get to start playing their game. Mm -hmm. But if you if you manage to keep in on them, they no longer get to play their game, and they have to play your game. Yeah. Uh, this is assuredly not the same John Wick for me. <laughs> no, most definitely not. Not the young child from Tucson. From Tucson. And what? Okay. What? Okay. That was a pretty good sequence to be right. Ooh, oh, my very good down there. Like, now it's actually a more or less even game. You know, Arson's out, so uh, if you can get those like low damage combos. Kind of gets them started. I uh, liked how B Rice covered himself with the uh, yeah, the void there. Yeah, the where even though he did, uh, Wick did get in on him, the Lloyd Rocket just to totally broke it up and reestablished it. Yeah. Oh, he's trying to he's trying to do a kick throw. Yeah. What they call in fight games, where you hit somebody with a weak move. Yeah. and then try to grab them immediately afterwards. Yeah, try to catch them like blocking or holding. Oh, what the. Man's really dumb. Wick, <laughs> you've got to have better DI than that. Please. But, yeah, um, yeah, uh, tick throws, where you, um, you, you kind of, like, just jab or tap at somebody lightly, and then, you know, you try and throw them, like, right immediately afterwards. Because the idea is a gamble that they'll either not be doing anything because they expect they're going to keep getting hit. Yeah, or if they're or blocking. If and they're, if, or that they'll try to, like, Block, it just keep hold block. Yeah, and, and then they just they'll get grabbed. Yeah, or if they try to like do, hit a button. Get get grabbed. Joker. Exactly. Yeah. This is actually tough. 
So we're obviously going on the Persona Memento stage. I wasn't paying attention to much version. Oh, FD. Okay. So. Oh, I guess he just wanted to play sad. Hey, I'm a Persona fan. No. I'm a Persona fan that just took four. Up. Hello? Excuse How me? How many times are you going to get jabbed? Like, what? That, that was not real, was it? Absolutely not. He could have gotten away from that. I'm almost entirely sure. Yeah. But I mean, like, I kind of like like the way, like the uh, rhythm or, yeah, of how uh, B-Rice was kind of jabbing at him. Because it was kind of like still leaving him in like the spot that he wanted him to stay in. Yeah. Right on ledge to where he can get more than, you know, like just three or four jabs that Isabel usually is allowed to have. Man, B-Rise did a really good job of uh, dodging all those back air attempts. How? I, I, I feel like I must have missed something because like now B-Rise is just like at 99%. But he's been getting hit this whole time, that's the thing. I yeah, like he's in there, but like, I feel like it's a little too much. I feel like uh, backed up a little bit. I mean, Nair is definitely... Oh, what? Come on now, man. Again, right. you gotta... You gotta You gotta not die. You gotta watch your directional influence. Yeah. That was, that was actually, like, really, really bad. And this is the, uh... The, the second, or third, or fourth, or tenth time that you died to something that you probably shouldn't have died to. Okay, our set is on, on the table though. Yeah. Dad is home. Dad is in fact home, and he is in fact not happy. Oh, pretty good for me, Rice. Uh, in that he knew uh, Wick was going to try to go aggressive there. Oh, he got out of the. That was a really good SDI. Yeah. But, uh, I don't know if it was or if he just got clipped by like the very end of the move and like, like fall out anyway. But that might have been. That could have been the case too. Oh man, I your last one. Good grab. Okay, that landing up air, not safe on shield. No, definitely not. Good bear. Gonna keep him off stage. But yeah, I've been wondering why he hasn't been using the downward gun to try to deal with the balloons. Yeah, he's like, not... I don't, I don't know. He's, he seems like more content to try to just like bear. Oh, well, there the guns now, but not really gonna do it. Yeah, it doesn't really do anything off of it. Okay, good uh, good use of the Rebel Stone. Uh, okay, hops right over the fireball. Also, uh, really fast, no scar, none of the lessons for free. That's why you had to pay money to view the... To, to be here. Well, I mean, you have to pay money to be in the tournament. Exactly. And for less. Oh, okay. He <laughs> knew that he was going to run back and just like try to do his projectile again. Yeah. So good call by B Rice on the. Ooh, oh, yeah. good call on the counter, too. Yeah. See, that's that's what it's like to catch on to your opponent's habits. Yeah. Is you do something which, technically speaking, as a sequence, shouldn't really work, but you know, because Some. you understand exactly what they're going to go for based on history, you can go for it. So. But the problem is, he's... Oh, my goodness. Oh, he's still alive, but... Actually, that wasn't necessary. He wasn't going to make it, but... He was dead anyway, but, yeah, like... That was pretty cool. You have to be aware of what your opponent can do off stage. Yeah. That was pretty good. But, um... Uh, the money technically is for the tourney, actually. Because I entered, and I have to pay $20 to play. Eh, not too well. Everybody's kind of like hot off of some good shoulder lessons. That's my and job. And they've been, for, you know, they've been playing all day. They've been practicing. Yeah, unlike me, who goes to work and goes to sleep. And <laughs> nah, I'm not gonna use that as my excuse. They they played well, especially this wit guy who actually who, who yeah, did beat me. This wit guy has been making it through. Yeah, he's been surviving. I guess we're gonna start off with the uh, the open taunts, cause yeah. Persona, I, I guess is cool. I guess. He has good music. He has, he has no jump, jump and but but tether. Yeah, he's got the and if you know best tether in the game. B-Rice did react to the fact that he had no jump and uh, yeah, uh, continue to, uh, to pursue him, him off stage. Yeah. And that's something that 
if you if you do catch on to it, you can kill a lot of people. Oh my. That almost like worked completely. Yeah, he rice definitely looking like he's catching on to a lot of what Wick wants to do. Sort of like the sequences that Wick likes to go for. Yeah. Because the uh, sort of run dash back uh, side Ouch. are not old. That was a forward smash, right? Mm-hmm. Explosive is like here. Yeah. Oh my. But, I mean, he had invincibility anyway, so it wasn't really going to do too much. I, I guess we, we got, we, I guess we got like the most taunts today. Yeah, it's very, very taunt having set. Yeah. Got more, uh, oh, class clowns. I don't know. But, skip it all. Oh. That was a good idea with the parry punish, but, again, when you, when you parry... It's kind of, you definitely have to notice right then and there. Yeah, you have to have like an idea ready, like on what it is you want right, right after you parry. And sometimes it's just uh, not the way. Yeah. I see like a lot of people like, well, I mean like when you parry, like I said, you have an idea. It's like you can either kill this person or not off the parry, or you can get a combo off the parry. I like that uh, you guys definitely winning these air to airs. Yeah. Hmm. Oh my. Definitely looks like uh, Wick maybe getting a little bit kind of frustrated with sort of maybe his inability to really land. Yeah, he's not Too getting many solid hits on yeah. Isabel. Ow. Oh, uh, the solid hits though. Yeah. Right, that's solid Dude, enough. About as solid as it gets, you know. <laughs> but I, I feel really like really good jab. That was the best Isabel jabs I've ever seen in my life. Yeah, they really are. I've never seen like an Isabel have like. I've jab never seen well. better jabs from Isabel. Yes, yeah, like <laughs> the jab, jab, turnaround, up tilt. That was tight. I don't know if that was actually like a combo. It, it can't have been, right? Most definitely not. You can't combo anything off of like jab. With you cannot combo game. anything off of Isabel jab. So that was definitely just Wick uh, asleep at the wheel. But uh, B Rice, yeah, Cut definitely uh, <laughs> showing a pretty strong command of the stage and sort of using playing playing that sort of long game where you just adapt more and more and more. To what your opponent likes to do. Yeah. So B Rise definitely, if if you or any of the other students reviewing these mods want to go ahead and take a look and see the sort of processes that B Rise went through, what B Rise did, what Wick did, and then what B Rise did after Wick did the things that he did after B Rise hit him. It's definitely something that you can look at to just sort of watch how the progression of interactivity between two players in the center.